invitation. Maddie, don't chase after that. You don't know what's in those buildings. No place is safe anymore. I don't understand what's happened to this city. Yes, another of their eccentric fancies. I suppose we've no choice but to play. It's going to be brilliant. It's going to be inexpressibly tiresome. If you're not going to have fun, maybe you should go home. I'll struggle on, once we locate the wine. Harold takes pride in being difficult. Jeez. As much as you take in being easy. Shall we go in? Emma insisted we need her out by the curb. Well, I'm going to catch plague and die waiting out here. I'm sure she'd like that. Why don't you wait here, as any gentleman would, and we'll go inside and make nasty remarks about Emma's style, or lack of it. Well, we know I'm no gentleman, so you might as well make them here. You have to feel sorry for her. She's only here to ask for a handout. She must be desperate. When have the Boyles ever given anything away? Maybe she hopes she'll win the game. Life is so boring. I'd die without gossip. We'll probably die anyway, waiting for Emma. I'll drink to that. Which part? Any of it. I damn, I want some wine. Are you looking forward to the party? Say so they didn't have it coming. Oh, that's an awful mask. Where can I get one? I should cut them out entirely. All of them. Pendleton? Is cards. that you? The half wit. Invitation, please. What did she expect? I told her I was trash. Invitation, please. Right this way, sir. What did she expect? I told her they were trash. Ah, Mr. Bunting. You just had someone here pretending to be you. Welcome. are bad. Could the city get any worse? Indeed. I believe so. Welcome, sir. Oh, and we have a game tonight. Esma, Lydia, and Waverly are wearing identical costumes in white, black, and red. You'll have to work out which of your hosts is wearing which color. Good luck. Another party game. It was fun for a season, but now? What is it tonight? Guess which is which. Their hair and makeup are identical, but one's in red, one's in black, one's in white. There's a prize at the end. The Boyle cameo. 
As if they don't get enough attention. Then again, the cameo is worth a lot. Doesn't Esma's bedroom have a balcony? If you could get up there, I bet you could find something. More likely, I'd end up in Cold Ridge Prison. The City Watch is everywhere tonight. But at least you're thinking. There must be another way. Waverly likes to be seen in red. Which everyone knows. Too obvious. You know, I hear there are other ways into Esma's bedroom. Oh, don't flatter yourself. Just thinking out loud, dear. I hear the whole second floor is off limits tonight. Too many guests walking off with their valuables. Welcome to the Boyle Estate. Most of the guests are inside. Might be best if you joined them. The party's indoors this time. I hope you're not lost, sir. You'll find everything inside. That's wicked. Who made that mask for you? It's exactly like the wanted posters. That's going to cast a pall over the whole evening. I think I'm starting to enjoy myself. Are you going to be playing the Boyle's game? Hello. The Boyle's hope you have a wonderful time tonight. Last night? Yes, of course. Cold night, sir. Please enjoy Over yourselves. Indoors. Inside. If you have something to say, say it to Lord Shaw. I'm on duty. Talk to Lord Shaw. <clears throat> Pendleton? Hmm. What's he got Should to say to me? Should we gather for whiskey and cigars tonight? Indeed, I believe Pendleton so. Pendleton is a gutless, lying sack of shit. I hope he's paying you well for this. It's damn cold tonight. Hurry up, and let's see what you're made of. Be it noted that Lord Pendleton's representative has a pistol. You may proceed. The test of honor will take place between this anonymous gentleman acting for the challenger Lord Trevor Pendleton and Lord Shaw, the challenged party. You will each turn and proceed to the marked positions and remain facing away from each other as I count down from three. You may then turn and fire Get at on will. with it. I'll kill this fool and we can all go back inside. Sorry, my lord. We shall proceed. Stop. Stand right there. Three. Two. One. And that's another patron dead. What do we do now? 
It's lucky we're in demand. I hear the Estermonts pay top coin. No use trying them tonight. Let's see if we can find a little brandy. Let the boils clean up the mess. Most of the guests are inside. Might be best if you join them. I hope you're not lost, sir. You'll find everything inside. Allow me. Careful. We tried for a peek upstairs and the man on duty is an ass. I should have taught him some manners. This party is a sham. I'm sure he's just doing his job. A party like this, anyone might have crept in. Excuse me, my cousin is a Marquis. Of course I don't mean you. But people are desperate, and the Boyles are awfully wealthy these days. Nonsense. Waverly just hires officers from the Watch to impress people. Your obsession with the Boyle women. Will it never end? Try Miss White in the moth mask. I hear she's lonely. That's quite a mask. Are you on the guest list? 
Are you trying to guess which one is which? I was thinking of sneaking upstairs to look for clues. Or would that be cheating? Squad after what happened last night? Yes, of course. the city get any worse? Indeed, I believe so. Did you hear about Mrs. Brimsley? You'll never believe this. What is it now? She had her jobber pick up a boy in the street, barely 16 years old. No family left. I thought her interests were confined to her family. I think she ran out of family a while ago. What's it all about? And how well, do you know this? My servants heard it from hers, naturally. They were sexual rights, I can only assume. Or else, I heard she bathed in her own nephew's blood. Ridiculous! What sort of hygiene is that? It's a ritual for the outsider. To keep them safe. Emma, you could get her sent to the Abbey. Nobody that rich gets sent anywhere they don't want. The Brimsleys made an awful lot of money this past century. Makes you wonder if those rituals work. What happened to the boy? I hear he enjoyed himself very much. For a while. Oh, fuck. Disgusting. Oh, hello. I'm Ella. Enjoy the party. If you can. Doing all right there? Getting peckish. We should have the girl bring food. Welcome to my party. I don't believe you've had the pleasure. Nasty rat. Get away. Welcome to the Boyle estate. Guests are advised to limit their enjoyment Ooh, to the ground nasty. floor. Maybe you should go elsewhere. <laughs> Careful. The Wall of Light is a gift from the Lord Regent, designed to keep his good friends safe. I doubt you qualify. money they must have. And I heard this is nothing compared to what's in the basement vault. I hear the key is upstairs in one of the bedrooms. If I could get it, I wouldn't even hesitate.
Should we gather for whiskey and cigars tonight? Indeed, I believe so. Trust you are on the guest list, sir. Don't bother me. I'm watching the hall. You should see this as an opportunity. To what? Doing Learn a right. trade. Join the city watch. Your house built its fortune in crisis. You can do so again. Land is worthless now. My buildings are full of corpses and rats. Where's the fortune there? If you want to be beaten, go right ahead. Welcome to the boy. Let your estate. family starve. Sell your wife into prostitution. I'm sure I can get you a good price. You son of a bitch. There's the old pirate spirit. Things are changing too fast to give up just yet. First that nasty mess with the Empress, now the High Overseer's gone. The Parliament is shifting. The whole city's turning upside down. If we only had a good war to get into. There you are. Although at this stage, I don't know who we could beat. But don't you see, we don't need to win a war, only lose it. Everything's revalued and we let the conquerors worry about the problems. Interesting. I'll be informing the Lord Regent of your ideas in the morning. You don't mean... One sister's in red, one in white, one in black. I'm stumped. My wife thinks we should sneak upstairs to look for clues, but I don't like the looks of those guards. Please, do you mind not interrupting us? Go ahead, take it. Everyone does. I had a servant sew me an extra pocket. Indeed. You there, stop that. I really should have received an invitation to the Boyle Estate. Hardly. What you missed your stop you too. What mischief are you up to? Have another drink, Byron. They don't serve cocktails in Coldridge Prison. I was only talking, thinking aloud. As was I, Byron. Now drink up. I know your mission tonight. We must speak. Privately. I'm a friend of Pendleton's, and I've done a few favors for your cause. I know your purpose here tonight, and, how to say this, your target is the woman I love. I swear that if you'll bring her to me unharmed, you will never hear of her again. There's a cellar directly below the kitchen. I'll wait for you there. I'm not proud of this, but surely it's better than seeing her killed. Her name is Waverly. I won't harm her, I swear. I'm a man of means. Just bring her to the cellar, and I will keep her safe with me. Forever. Evening, sir. I trust you're behaving yourself. What most people don't remember is, the rats came a half a year before the Empress died, and the plague do. Are you sure? That's not how I remember it. If something caused this, it's not the Empress's passing. That's what they want you to think. Watch what you're saying. I say nothing against the Lord Regent. He's the only one holding this together. He'll make us great again. Some of us will be great. The Boils, at least. Now, now. It's just like they found crystals on their land. And that we can't make the rat lights without them. And we can't get rid of the rats. Hello, sir. Rat lights and whale oil. That's all we live for now. What we can I found get out what the whales could do well, to make us an empire. This is the beginning of a golden age. Do you know they've dug down and found the ruins of another city under this one? 
before the overseers, before Doing anything. Doing all right there. Hello, I bet sir. I they thought they were in a golden age, too. You need another drink, friend. Cunning costumes. But there must be a way to guess. They say Lydia's the sloppy one, and Waverly's a prude. Or is it the other way around? If only I could peek upstairs for clues. You, a gentleman? I'll have you know I'm as gentle as I you want to join us for hunting next year? year? In the month of wind? I think I've proven. I told you not to bring that up. There's a great deal I could offer you. Don't be silly. The rumors say the Boyles practically yes, own your estate. What if I said I could get you out of the city, away from all this, to Sir Conos or further? I don't believe you. But if you're telling the truth, we should talk further, but not here. Excuse me? Oh, leave him be. It's a party. This is a private conversation. It's a party. It's called mingling. Mingle all you want, then. We'll speak later. I'll find you. Good evening. Stop at once. Lazy is its own reward. Uh-huh. <laughs> 
sinful mask. I'm sure in a few drinks I'll find that mask funny. Do cheer up. Tonight we're drinking with Death himself. Perhaps it's the outsider come amongst us. Will our sisters in the oracular order make a pronouncement regarding the plague soon? <coughs> Who invited you? You don't look familiar, and I know everyone. Bother me again, and I'll speak to the guards. I heard Lord Brisby was looking for you. Enjoying yourself? Anything you need, sir. Come and entertain me. You're a scandal in that mask. I like a man with poor judgment. Would you get me a drink? I'd be so grateful. By the outside, we should have another garden party. Like last year. Hello again. I can't get over your mask. Enjoying yourself? You remember? Who's who? Enjoying you yourself. You seem interesting. Hello, sir. I love that mark on the back of your hand. Who brought him, I wonder? I do hope it wasn't Mrs. Brimsley. Thank you so much. Now, how can I thank you? Are you playing Lady Boyle's guessing game? Well, I know for a fact that Waverly's in red tonight. That wanton thing. Additionally, Lydia's in white. So mysterious. Do you know? I think you might be lonely. What is it? Oh, really? Tell me. No, I don't know you. I'm not even sure you're on the guest list. What do you mean, you'll save my life? What? 
Why? Who sent you? Very well. I... I've no wish to die. But I won't wait long. And if you're lying, I'll see you hang. Lord Brisby has arrived. Delightful. him too? An unfortunate lapse of taste. I need that prize. If I could get upstairs, one of them must have left choices. Anything you need, sir. <sighs> Society isn't what it was. Beat it. You shouldn't be here. Get her on board. Last. Oh, my love. Someday you will understand. You'll never know how happy you've made me. Someday she'll learn to appreciate me. After all, she'll have her whole life. Get her on board. Last. Oh, my love. Someday you will understand. You'll never know how happy you've made me. Someday she'll learn to appreciate me. After all, she'll have her whole life. <laughs> 